Hey guys, Misto here, and welcome back to Season 3 of the 100 Day Challenge, starring Maxwell, master of forgetting what he was doing. So uh, at one point we talked about exploring and uh, bringing back some resources from this island, because this one has a lot of primo resources we want to have at our base. Like, uh, there's the one berry bush, there might be another one. Doesn't look like one that an island with like the big patches of nine. Like, there's usually one island that spawns that just has, like, all the berry bushes. Like, you don't have, like, three or four places of nine. So we didn't get that lucky. Probably. But, uh, that is a good place. You know, just grab that one. Bring it back. Why not? Add it to our nine. Our floaty boaty knights are back. We can go and murder them. And, uh, this is where WX starts getting insane. Their natural respawn time is so short that if we just kill them... Their HP is so much that they basically cause the floaty boaty knights to spawn again, like within the next day or two. So if you can survive to this point through all the two the two rainy seasons, oh, that's the hard part, getting through the two rainy seasons. WX starts getting insane, and uh, I'm re like, oh, man, like I'm ha I have mixed emotions about that playthrough, like. Just being able to deal with the rain is going to be a huge luck sack. Like, we have to find pigs. We've got to get an umbrella. Or we've got to find a trunk whenever we play uh, WX so that we can get the uh, the umbrella. Or we have to go really, really, like, ham. And we have to kill a uh, tiger shark so that we can make the umbrella. It's just going to be, like, that's going to be a hard character to finish this on, I believe. Like, once we get here, it'll be Easy sailing, easiest character once we get to the point that floaty boaty knights keep spawning. But getting to that point, that's gonna be the challenge. Alright, so uh, for today, we're just gonna we're gonna transfer some of these things. We have too many things in there that we don't really want. And uh, we do want that to be useful. These we can finish crop tropping, because that's what we were doing uh, during the night. We want them all to grow around the same time. These will be a little delayed, that's fine. Uh, we'll have enough for uh, two, three more buoys now? No, just the two because we don't have the bioluminescence. But that's fine. The extra bamboo is always good. We should be stacking that to the roof. Uh, drop this down. Uh, oh, you're fine, you can have those seats. Ugh. And uh, we'll equip this. It's fine. We need room to be able to bring back our stuff. So we're going to store the balloons. We're going to store our poop, poop chest, poop chest, poop chest 420. For the top chest, okay. That's the top chest. There we go, 19, 20 poop. We got a lot of poop. And uh, we... Alright, we need to make our uh, bottles. Excellent. So, we're just coming over here to uh, clear out this inventory. We have a lot of stuff in there. And you know, after, maybe tomorrow, we're going to go exploring. Let's see. Let's get a boat lantern. Let's get this. And, uh, ooh, I want to get the stinger off my boat. So let's bring that back. We need one more stinger to make a boat repair kit, which would be nice to have on the boat. Uh, that's kind of why I was leaving this on there to begin with. But we could just go next door to kill a, uh, a bee to get a stinger. And, uh, you know what? I think that's what we're going to do. Put this on the ground. We're going to go get them. And, uh, we can put this in here. We can use our extra stuff to make a beautiful uh, snakeskin rug. Just one, sadly. Uh, we'll pick up any poop we see along the way. There we go. That's nice. Uh, now it's raining again. This is always with the rain. Just calm down, game. Oh, we can put this on here. Uh, this is mainly going to be our uh, warship and what we use for the, uh, the coming uh, apocalypse. Whenever it uh, starts raining down dragoon eggs and we retreat to the water. So what we're looking for here is we want the bees. We want the angry bees. There's just one. Um, he's really close to home. Can you, uh, can you just walk away from home for a bit? Like, I don't want to kill you right next to your home because all your homies are going to come out of your home and mess me up. Here, get angry at me because you're in spring and follow me. No, what? You're not following me. There, follow me. There, there, yeah, 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 yeah. This is what we want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get him. One, two, three, and we got our uh, stinger. That's exactly what we needed. All right, let's leave. 
killing all of these bees would be nice, but it's not worth losing everything else for. My god, we lost the 1 HP already. Oh, and we lost 2% of our armor. That's basically GG. Uh, we parked up here in the watery part, didn't we? We did. So, let's go home, pick up some more of this poop. Beautiful, beautiful poop. It's just so amazing. We're at 6, we're at 70 uh, wetness, and we're still not losing sanity. Uh, we might, at this level of wetness, lose some sanity during night, but the only real factor impacting us is that all of our stuff is wet. That means our fuel is wet for the fire, which makes it, I think, half or two-thirds as effective as normal. I think it's half. And, uh, you know, that's not too bad, and we've got fuel in chest. Like, we have so much poop in chest. We have, uh, 39. Plus, pick up this poop, Maxwell! Ooh. Now, I don't know if mangroves can catch on fire, and if they do catch on fire, if they spread. Ooh. You know what? Since we're here, let's go ahead and, uh, pop out here and fertilize these. With our wet manure. Boop. 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 And boop. So the rest of these will probably need to be fertilized uh, as soon as the next berry harvest comes in. And, uh, our meat's starting to go bad. You know, I think during the dry season we're going to have to look towards making, um, what's it called? we got to make, oh, trains of thought are not in the station. We need to make drying racks so that our meat lasts longer that's really going to help us out because it doubles the length of this food. We can even put jellyfish and we can put seaweed on there. I'm still not sure why seaweed works like that. Now we don't, we want to go ahead and make, we want to do some crafting tonight, but uh, let's cook up some food first because uh, Maxwell's actually starting to starve. Now, let's see. So let's be efficient with our place. We don't need our shovel right now. Let's put that down. We don't need our axe right now. We're carrying around so many tools that we're not even planning on using. Alright. So first up, we need a board and a rope. What do we need for our parakeet? Two boards? Oh my goodness, that's so expensive. I can't believe it costs so much. It's almost cheaper to make a boat. It really is. But uh, we're going to do it anyways. Grab this up because we're about to starve. And we'll go ahead and make another one immediately. Just pop that in there. Pop in our nice little filler. Oh, those are starting to go bad, but that's fine. This guy's going to come and mess with us, but that's okay too. So let's go ahead and I'll make our boat repair kit. That's going to go back over to that other boat. Hey, hey, you want to tussle? You want to tussle? Ha! Tussle with this! Oh, you got me. Stung me. But that's okay. We'll get this. We'll stock up on these. These will make us very rich as far as healing goes in the future. And uh, next up on the docket, we are... Uh, we made our repair kit. Let's pick up these. Let's get out our coral. And I think with our seaweed, we can make a couple of these. Two or three. I don't remember if it's three seaweed or two. Uh, three seaweed, so we can make two of these. And, yep, got rid of that. We have enough coral. We have enough of venom glands and coral to make three more. We just got to get a lot of seaweed. But uh, that's if we even want to. We have four, four of these. Oh, no, there's no examine. That's fine. So, uh, yeah, there's that. There we go. We can put our coral back up. Uh, let's get a log on the fire before we die. And then let's try to get... Oh. Dry me out. Dry me out so I can put some dry stuff on you. Oh, they're waterlogged. Oh. Come on, fire. Fire. Ah, oh. oh, fine. Come on, get me. Don't get pack him. Five, six, and he's dead. <laughs> he's just, just get angry. Get angry at pack him. Uh, yeah. So we are so close to the end of the season. Four days left. Yeah, that means we might have like one more rain. Ooh, you know what? Boom. There we go. 2020 poop. Aw, oh, yeah. Oh, let's just be a little more. There we go. We'll be nice to our... Anyone who's watching who might have AD, who, uh, OCD, not ADD. That's a very, very different, uh, very different thing. You know what? Our vines are there. Let's go ahead and put our bamboo here, too. We don't have bamboo anywhere else, right? All right. So we've got a lot of gears. We can go get more gears. Let's zoom out the mini-map a little bit. 
Did we really want that much more? Ugh, those are the only ones. Okay, that's fine. Alright, so... Uh, we now have space. We I guess we just don't need these sandbags. As soon as I put them down, I'm going to need them. And uh, we'll put up bioluminescence. And uh, just anywhere it can fit, really. We're just trying to get rid of it. There we go. Got rid of it. Let's grab our shovel. And let's just... Uh, Let's go and dig up some stuff and come back home. I'm going to put the boat repair kit on the cargo boat. That's my favorite place to put it. and Because, uh, you know, it can just hold it. It can just hold its own heels. It's extra 300 HP for our uh, thing. I also have this machete here. And I don't know how we're going to use this machete to our advantage. So is this uh, shark was still... Yeah, he is still fighting these guys. It takes him forever to kill them. I don't know if he can't kill them whenever we're off screen or what. But uh, we're gonna grab our seaweed too. This is growing so fast in the season, or maybe we didn't pick this before. We're gonna come up the way, all the way up here, and get this. And uh, our snakeskin hat is just excellent for killing jellyfish. That'll let us spawn the floaty boaty knights basically as fast as they can actually spawn. And uh, I still haven't figured out if coral regrows or not. We do want to mine more of it, but uh, if it doesn't regrow, I don't know why it just sits there once it's uh, mined up. It is like a living thing, so you know, it could make sense for it to grow back. Maybe not as fast as it does, if it does. But uh, you know, nope, I got no problems with that. So let's see. We're gonna hop off here. We want to bring back vines and bamboo. So here we go, vine. And this will actually give us the vines that we want. Like, just in our inventory. We don't really need the vines yet. But we could make a rowboat. And uh, I believe rowboat is actually the most efficient boat as far as, like, just using it goes. It's really cheap to make, especially if you have access to vines. And it loses the least amount of HP per time of sailing. Which makes it one of the best boats. Ooh. That one's got a snake in it, so we're just going to walk away. Let's uh, zoom in so we can see these a little better. Pick up our seeds. And let's try to bring back, I don't know, 10, 10 vines and 10 bamboo. It's good. Plus our, uh, oh, we didn't bring our hammer. We were going to get the pig houses, too. And, uh, of course, that's there. Ooh, is there a living tree here? Yeah, so we got a perfectly regular jungle tree. So that'll be good for us. That'll help us. Uh, we've seen a couple. But that'll be one that's even closer so that we can uh, start working on our magic tier. We do really want to. There we go. We get two of these? That's excellent. That's just excellent. I saw this move, but it doesn't have a little icon. Yeah, that's nice. All right. We weren't tricked by it. So if we can get like two or three of these, that'd be excellent. That'd be great and space efficient. We're almost done on our bamboo. We do have quite a bit growing at home, so that's fine. We have almost no vines at home, though. That's like a big problem. That's why we had to give up on the uh, <laughs> the rowboat and just make the armored boat for uh, picking up poop, which is a terrible idea. Uh, I do not recommend it. And, uh, we're gonna, yep, there's our vines. Yes, Maxwell, I know. Do you know how I know? Because you tell me every five minutes. Ugh, Maxwell. All right, so there we go. Pick up this last berry bush here. That is most of the resource we can just go home and spend the night at home. We're, we're done here. We're done. Oh, we can just peel out this area. Just check it out. Oh, we want to get these guys. We'll hammer down this box. We'll come back with a hammer uh, in tomorrow. On tomorrow. At least one box isn't super worth it. It's just going to be like one, one board and possibly another board or some other loot. So it's not a huge priority. But the main thing when we come back is just have room to pick up the pick houses. But uh, this is a really nice way to spend one one evening. You know, not too bad. Oh, we're at five C. We pick this up. We can go home and make two more anti venoms and just be extra safe. You know, safety first. That has been our motto on Maxwell. After we killed the Quacken, we started the game saying, "Well, if I die for the second episode, then oh well. You know, nobody's time was actually wasted this time. Instead of uh, what we did with Wilbur." Where we found a great island, started setting up, and then said, eh, let's go hard. We're not going to fight this guy during rainy season, so we may as well fight him now. 
And uh, then we paid the piper. We died. Died a horrible death. And you know, I've talked about making these muscle sticks for a few episodes. I still haven't done it. It competes against buoys for resources. Like, we have to have the, uh, the bamboo to make it. And I don't even know what else goes in it. Is it under food or survival? It's probably under food, right? Yeah, there it is. Muscle stick. We actually have the stuff to make it right now. You know what? Let's let's do it. There are no heavy rains. Let's make the muscle stick. See how much food we can get. Eventually, it'll be like six. That's okay. Oh, it's just like it's just fish though. It has no meat value, so it's not really that good. But we can just cook them up and eat them raw. So you know, nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that. And uh, here we go. We're gonna come up here. Boop. Plant that down as close as it'll let us. Yep, there we go. And uh, we don't have geometric placement on, so whatever happens, happens. Whatever happens, happens. Ooh, yeah, we're definitely getting curved here. Oh, we're getting really far away. There we go. Ooch, ooch. Oh, no, it's not letting us. Oh, man, I would have sworn that it was geometric placement stopping that. Oh. There we go, we gotta get out our poop. Right, we gotta kill this mosquito, because he's just gonna threaten us all night. Oh no, I messed up, I messed up! I messed up. Okay, I'm not looking at you, I'm not looking at you, sir. Oh, I'm just walking over here. Oh, 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 I got you! Oh, hit me again, though. Uh, yes, get angry at that bird. How dare he? How dare he? Oh, we don't have anything. Just put some wet grass on the fire. Okay. There we go. We did that. Uh, let's get out our poop. Let's just burn this jungle turf. It's non-renewable, but who cares? Get out of here. We don't want you anyways. Actually, jungle turf is one of the best ones to just have. Just hanging around. Get these in here. I know it's not a peach basket, but you know, you don't deserve a peach basket. You're in timeout. Six, got him. And then we hit pack him just because we're angry at him, I guess. I don't know. Maxwell just really does not like pack him anymore. Ooh, this pumpkin's going bad. Let's go ahead and uh, cook that up. Oh, uh, we didn't uh, get our honey to make anything, but it gives a lot of food anyways. You know what? These are going bad too. Let's go ahead and cook that up. Eat it. Om nom nom. Delicious HP. Oh, uh, these durians are going bad. How much are they worth? How much are they worth if we cook them? Let's look at both. Uh, 25 and minus 5 sanity. Is 16 hunger, minus 3 health, minus 5 sanity. So cook them up, it's no bad. Yeah, durians are actually... Uh... Ooh, hounds are coming. Is that hounds? That's hounds, right? I think that's hounds. Let's get our spear ready. Yeah, hounds are growing restless. Uh... Let's see. Let's... You know what? We have not tried fighting them on the water. Let's try to get them to come as sharks. So we're going to zoom out a bit so we can see when they come. And uh, we're going to pick up some poop. Why not? Oh, I thought that mosquito was a hound. I was like, why did he spawn on the ground? We're going to be out here. Actually, I cannot hear at all the warning sounds for uh, sharks. Unless they're just not playing. Oh, it seems I'm being pursued. But that is fine. That is our goal. We want them to spawn as sharks, and we want to try to get them to fight the water beefalo. We're going to use our resource. We have a lot of beefalo, so this should be fine. Like, I don't think that even a full wave. And uh, it'll let us know uh, how well they can fight. Like, this will give us a little preview of if it's worth it or not. And uh, if the sharks do win, then we're just going to cry. We're going to cry. But uh, let's... They're pooping themselves. These guys are ready. Hurry up! I came out here because I've heard like three or four warnings already. Oh, is that a shark? These are sharks. These are sharks coming for us. They're coming for our butt cheeks. Oh, there we go. Now they're going to get wrecked. Riggity, riggity, wrecked. Uh, so, yeah, the water beefalo are really good at fighting these guys. Ooh. Oh, my goodness. The double bite. Really? 
Calm down. Fight a beefalo. Save a boat. Fight a beefalo. This guy is like, oh my god, he won't let us leave. He won't not fight us. Oh, there we go. He's going for someone. There we go. So let's pick up what we got. There's a shark fin there. So we can make a shark fin hat. And uh, But hopefully we get a hound's tooth out of all this. Like These guys did a lot of work for us for us to not get any hound's teeth. Really? Okay. That's fine. So, yeah. Uh, we can just deal with our uh, our problems by coming out here. We can just let the beefalo handle everything for us. I don't see any problem with that. I don't see any problem. You guys see a problem with that? I don't see a problem with that. That seems efficient. So, we've got the poop. We've got the power. Ooh, let's grab this. We can make our three antivenoms. There we go. That's what we're doing. Boom. Nine seaweed. Planned. Planned. Alright, so we got enough to plant up these. We'll just grab more poop out of the container. Let's get these berry bushes. Hey, can I get stuck? There we go. Uh, yeah, there we go. So, come down here. We'll uh, plant these up next to our berry bushes. Just, yeah, nice and pretty, right? We'll be friends. Boop. And... Boop. Beautiful. Beautiful. Who needs geometric placement? Who needs geometric placement? Not I. Not I. Alright, let's do this the way I prefer. Let's start at the top. So that it, uh... Actually, these doesn't matter. They get smaller once you fertilize them. Huh? <laughs> what? Oh, we double fertilized it. It just... <gasps> we can double fertilize these to just get insta... Insta... Or did that just happen to grow? I don't know which one happened there. Oh, I don't know. That's okay. Let's, uh, let's plant these vines north of our base. Let's get them here. Where this vine is. That way it'll continue being defended. And let's... Plant this here. Oh my goodness, we gotta go far away. There we go. Oh, oh just slightly. There we go. <laughs> Maxwell just plant the thing. Oh, get out of here. Om nom 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 nom. I will eat you flower for inconveniencing me. There we go. Plant that. That's a four of them. Here's five. Now, I don't think these will just become snake spawners if we plant them. Like, I think it's okay. We should be okay. Oh, Maxwell's just a fan of the raven. He's just a like, brave every weekend. It's all he ever did in college, and it's all he's doing in his real life. Ooh. Put, put, put it down. And that, oh, this gives us 11 of these. Oh, whatever. Let's just plant it here. That's oh, fine. Forgot if we planted next to one, obviously that gave us the bonus one. Whoa. So, uh, this guy's flying around. He might sting us while we're doing this, but... That's fine. All in a day is pooping. So before, this... I don't know if this is getting wet from me holding it. Oh! No, now I know it's not wet. Excellent. All planned. All planned. That was intentional. So we can go ahead and put uh, three of these on the fire. Yeah, you can go ahead and sting at me. That's fine. Yeah, no, I'm not. Oh, I'm not looking at you. Oh, I am looking at you. Ha! Huh? God, these mosquitoes. We can pick these up. I'll put this in our poop chest. That's fine. Uh, this is our one with this. Uh, we can pick this up. Oh, and that was our chest with the coral. This one, there we go. There we go, so we can go ahead and uh, cook these up. One, two, three. We could make four. Oh, we need another. We need more seaweed. We're up to seven cures. So we are uh, hashtag overcompensating for uh, our early... What was it, like day eight poisoning? That was just terrible. And how do we make this shark fin hat? It is somewhere in here. It's down here. Ooh, umbrella. Sleek hat. We need a coconut. Oh. Okay. Yeah, there's no coconut sitting around. We have the vines. Let's uh let's just get this in here. We're gonna freshen up these by putting that on there. There, they're nice and fresh now. 
And we can go ahead and start cooking this up. We have these bananas in case we want to make, you know, banana pops to fix our sanity issues. Oh, wait a minute. We don't have those. So the bananas are just going to be filler, really. Or they can go to rot. Either way, it doesn't matter. Uh, we are doing excellently on food, so why... Why try to be safe? Boom! Just like max stats always. This is what we do in our life. Stop picking on Pack'em! Ugh. I don't want to fight him because he's just like out in the, uh, the darkness. But, uh, man. So, monsoon season is ending. We have like one more day. Uh, 55? It says two more days, but I think once it ticks over, it'll be one more day. Whoa, did you just die from attacking Pack'em? What? Seriously? Do they get hurt? Like, do they die from a stinging? What? We got 200 HP in the bank. We got our uh, beautiful ballfin free tuna. Totally ballfin free. Uh, monsoon season is coming to a close. This should take over to one day. And then the next episode, we start the dry season. We have a few days where the puddles will start going away, where the weather will be nice. And uh, then everything terrible will happen two three four five six get out of my base all right guys we're gonna call this episode here i will catch you in the next one what's got us